bucket siya 10. Kasi if we're going to multiply it 3 times, the result is 1,000. 10 times 10, 100. Times 10, 1,000. Okay? Okay, we have to factor A cube plus B cube. Okay, this is uh, this topic is about uh, sum and difference of two cubes, but in this case, so this is positive, so this is sum of two cubes. Okay, so we have to find the two factors. Okay, the first factor and the second factor na trinomial. Yung first factor natin dito is a binomial. Okay, so una we have to the first factor, kunin natin yung cube root ng A. So, that is A. And since positive yan, kupin muna natin yan si positive. And the cube root of B. Okay? So, is B. Okay, ngayon, kunin natin yung second factor. So, anong isulat natin dito? So, yung first step natin dito is we have to square the first factor first term of the first factor so we have to square that one so magiging a squared okay and then next we have to subtract the product of a and b so magiging minus a b okay then the last one is we have to square the second term of the first factor so magiging plus b Square. So we have to factor a cube minus b cube. So this topic is about the uh, difference of two cubes. Two cubes. It's because of a perfect cube. The first term natin or first uh, first term natin is uh, perfect cube, and the second term is also a perfect cube. Okay. So paano siya factor? Una, kunin natin yung dalawang factor nila. Okay. So first. We have to factor the, uh, we have to get the cube root of a cube, or the first term and the second term. So, factor, uh, cube root ng a cube is a. Okay. Since, uh, difference yan, sulat natin yan minus. Then, yung cube root ng ating second term is b cube man yan. So, magiging b. Kasi b times b, b squared times b, b cube. Okay. Then, dito sa second factor, okay, so, we need to square the first term of the first factor. The first term ito, so, magiging a squared. Then, next, we have to subtract the product of the first term and second term. So, um, subtract daw, so, since negative ito, so, magiging positive na ito ngayon. A B, ito yung product ng A and B okay? And the last term Is We have to square the last term Ito si B So magiging plus B Squared Okay So we will factor 27x cubed Plus 1000 So we will use factoring by Sum of 2 cubes Bakit gamitin natin yung factoring by Factoring by sum of 2 cubes it's because itong first term ay perfect cube and itong 1,000 yung second term is also a perfect cube. Bakit sum of two cubes? Kasi positive yan. Okay? So, dito tayo sa baba. Okay? So, una, we have to get the cube root of 27x cube dito sa ating first factor. So, unahin mo natin si 27. Ang cube root yan is 3. Bakit siya 3? Kasi if we're going to multiply it 3 times, the result is 27. 3 times 3 times 3 times 3 is 9 times 3 is 27. Then yung cube root ng cube root ng x cube, that is x. x times x, x squared times x, x cube. Okay? Then kupihan natin yung plus sign kasi sum of 2 cubes tayo. Then kunin natin yung cube root ng 1000. So, the cube root of 1,000 is 10. Bakit siya 10? Kasi if we're going to multiply it 3 times, the result is 1,000. 10 times 10, 100. 
times 10, 1,000. Okay? Next is we have to get the second factor. So, yung second factor natin dito, now we have to multiply or we have to square the first term of the first factor. So, since 3x yung first term natin, is square natin yan, that is 9x squared. 3x times 3x is equal to 9x squared. Okay? And then, we have to subtract the product of the first and second term. So, subtract natin yan. Then, kunin natin yung product nila. So, 3x times 10, that is 30x. Okay? And then, last, we have to square the second term. We square natin yung second term. So, since this is 10, square natin yan. The result is 100. So, plus 100. So, this is our factored form of 27x cubed plus 1000. So, we have to factor 8b cubed minus 64m cubed. Okay, so we will use the factoring by uh, difference of 2 cubes. Okay, bakit sa difference of 2 cubes? Kasi si first term and second term ay perfect cubes. At saka itong sign nila ay minus. That's why we will use factoring by uh, difference of 2 cubes. Okay, so una, we have to get the cube root of B, uh, 8B cubed para sa ating first factor. So, cube root ng 8, that is 2. Diba? Bakit siya 2? Kasi i-multiply natin yan tatlong beses, ang result ay 8. 2 times 2, 4 times 2, 8. Then, si B cubed naman, ang cube root niya is B. Kasi B times B is B squared times B is B cubed. So, that's why nagiging 2B ang cube root ng 8 B cube. Okay? Then, since difference tayo, so, kopya natin yung minus dyan. Then, kunin natin yung cube root ng 64 m cube. So, ang cube root ng 64 ay 4. Kasi, multiply natin yan tatlong beses, the result is 64. 4 times 4, 16. Times 4, 64. Then, yung m cube, that is m. Okay? So, ito na yung first factor natin. So, kunin natin yung second factor niya. Okay, so yung una dito, so first term ng second factor natin is we have to square the first term of the first factor. So since 2B yung first term natin dito, so square natin yan, that is 4B squared. Kasi kung i-multiply natin yan, dalawang beses, si 2B, so the result is 4B squared. Okay, next we have to... Uh, subtract the product of 2B and 4M. So, minus yan. So, subtract natin. So, kung i-multiply natin yung minus or uh, negative times negative, that is positive. Okay? So, product nito, 2B times 4M, that is equal to 8BM. Okay? So, yun ang product niya. Then, yung last term is square natin itong last term ng uh, first factor or second term ng first factor. So, square natin yan that is positive 16 m squared. Kasi, 4 times 4 is 16 m times m m squared. So, ito na yung factored form ng ating 8 b cubed minus 64 m cubed. Bye-bye. Let's go.